Hey everybody, welcome back. Another episode of Slay the Spire. I don't think we have beaten the game as the silent is the thing. So let's try that, shall we? Alright. Yeah, I guess we can remove a defend. No attacks coming in still. Can we deal a ten damage? We can. Goodbye. Right. I'll go ahead and start with the poison stab. It's a decent card. We will upgrade two random cards, a defend and a strike. Yay! Kind of a crappy one to get early because it's it's a high likelihood that it's gonna upgrade one of these. All right, thirteen damage coming in. We will block eight. We will block thirteen. We will deal one six damage. Roll up one enemy. We will neutralize you. Now we have eleven damage coming in. We will poison you. We will kill you. We will survivor and take no damage. Oh right, I had 14 damage I upgraded the car. I was like, how did I get hurt? Bye. Dagger throw is demonstrably good. Uh, I do that one too often and I end up losing health that I don't need to lose and starts a whole downward spiral. damage or block 14. We can put up 12, thankfully. Goodbye. Backstab is really good. Bullet time is very, very good. Wow, these are all good choices. I think I'll take bullet time. Because bullet time is just, it's just a good card. And I think we will immediately upgrade it. Choke is good considering that we're running a, um, that we have bullet time. Any, any higher co cost cards that are higher than one are going to be a good idea. We'll lose max hit points for that relic. This is an elite fight on this one. We'll go this way to get the elite fight. Toxic egg. <laughs> uh, you mean ML? Okay. Means skills, so I think this is already expertise plus. So, given our um, bullet time, drawing and then bullet timing can be a very good strategy. Magabulin! Alright. We will choke him. We will neutralize him. We will poison him. We have bullet time. We'll strike you. We'll strike you again. We'll defend. We'll survive. We'll take five damage. Ow. 
We will expertise. We will dagger throw. We will survivor. Choke you, neutralize you, and strike you. No expertise. We will dagger throw. Crap. Do we need two, two energy to play the bullet time? You dumb. Dumb person. Neutralize. You're taking, we're taking unnecessary damage now, because you weren't thinking. Wow, we took an extraordinary amount of damage. Okay. I think we will skip those cards, none of them seem appealing. We will have to rest, unfortunately. And it's a fight. Oh. I'll neutralize you. We will draw. Did not draw bullet time. We will defend, and we will survive her. Still taking an unacceptable amount of damage. Choke. You're dead. Well, I should have. Yeah, it doesn't matter really. Flying knee, I like. Flying knee is always a good idea. Getting bullet time on the first turn is a good. Is is good. Because of uh, Ring of the Snake, we have the cards to, you know, kind of make it work. Choke you. Draw cards. Darn it. to keep sneaking in damage on me. Again, I have to rest. I'm going into this boss fight with less than half health. More well, like exactly half health. Always find a way to play more cards after choke. It's always gonna be good. Survivor, we will defend, we will play. The black one.
hate to burn all my potions, but I really don't want to die on this boss. It'll be a very short episode. <laughs> so I can choke and then bullet time. Not the same situation this time. So bullet time, then choke. I'm gonna hit you, and you died. Got low there, but we brought it, we pulled it back. Pulled it back from the brink. I think Venom is worth taking. I don't, I don't like these. I don't like transform relics. Uh, transforming, it just like has a chance to give me cards that do not work with my deck. I feel like expertise is. Not what did I get? Flying knee, leg sweep, and a and a upgraded dagger throw. Well, yeah, that's fine. Yep, the uh, flying knee is pretty good. The upgraded flying knee and leg sweep is fine. That's not gonna happen. Should have played that first. Be card number twenty, so we'll keep let's keep that in mind. Yeah, crippling poison crippling cloud or whatever it's called. Or bad card. Select. Crippling cloud. You're dead. You will be. Sh you'll, you'll be shortly. Having thorns against those guys is just murder. Murder, death, kill. Why 
Why take eight damage when you can take one? Oh boy. I don't know if I have enough health to. Another question mark and then a bonfire. Let's do it. In Caridian, random power at the start of each turn. Wait a second. Did I not take it? Turn. Take the thing! I didn't. Ah, oh. are you actually kidding me? Take the, the give me the relic. Oh, you gotta be effing joking me. Fine. They shouldn't. That shouldn't. That should not be able to happen. You should be able to go back and pick it up. Oh, that's really stupid. I just wasted all that health for nothing. Probably gonna die now. Yeah, I'm hurting you every time you hit me, you dumb bitch. So tilted. I'm not even making good choices right now. Not dead, but I'm close. Leave you on one, let the poison kill you. Oh lord. Well, I'm just- I'm probably just gonna die now. What are you defending for? They're not attacking yet. Leaving damage on the table. Yeah, I'm dead. Ugh, I can't believe I burned all that health against this, on the book and then it didn't let and then I accidentally clicked away and then it wouldn't let me go back. That's really frustrating. I guess we'll do another one. We'll do the defect this time. That is really annoying. Use strikes. Use so carbon for a defect deck. That's funny. Pile driver. Compile driver. I will do Hello World. Hello World is a good power to have. I'll move another strike. Alright. Hello World. Stop. And. Matthew. 
you defending for than I attack them. Rebound's a good card. I, reprogram has never seemed useful to me. I just don't think like deck parsing is that important in Slay the Spire. Like the way scrying is in magic. It just never really seemed useful to me. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm really undervaluing the card. Version's a good card. The third time I've seen Compile Driver, it's like he really wants me to take it. Smith. Don't prepare. It's a card that has no value during boss fights, but it'll help you get to the boss fight. <laughs> We cannot kill you. This is going to be a lot of damage. Yikes. Hacking in with lightning. Taking a lot of damage. No real way to prevent it. Some of it back though, regen potions helping helpful as well. I think another recursion's okay. Oh, Dark Stone Periat. A little, little bit of a silver lining if I pick up curses. Feeling there. Next to Nate, that's not that helpful. Making white noise free is okay. Machine learning is really the power to have. We will continue to tank every hit. What is that? Yes. 
There's some defect runs where I can't stop gaining block, and, and then there's others where I just cannot ever block. Oh, dude, would you like to just take 21 damage at the beginning of the fight? Sure, sure. Yeah, I'd love to do that. Would you like to be able to do nothing about it? Yeah, I'd like to too. I don't think I have a big deck. It's 15 cards. I mean, only four of them are blocks. Well, three of them are blocks. Yeah, I just tried to I should have taken reinforced ladder though. God damn. Really pay attention to things you literally just said. Alright, slime boss. Let's talk, you and I. damage there. Fifty nine is not a great score. Dead. I think I'm dead. Yep, I'm dead. Wow. This is a couple of disappointing runs in a row. That was really pathetic. Oh, enjoyed that. Just hit that like button. Back for more of my pathetic gameplay in the future. <laughs> we'll see you next time.